Hi, welcome back. The problem today is a very tricky exponential equation. There is a x plus x power of x on the left side and on the right side we have 6. And the condition is x are is positive real numbers. Now we have to find x to satisfy the equation. Now let's get started. To solve this equation, we have to divide the x into two cases. The first case is x is smaller or equal to 1 and greater than 0. In this case, x is smaller or equal to 1 and x power of x is on way rated smaller or equal to 1 as well so the equality in this case cannot happen because the left side on way smaller or equal to 1 plus 1 equal to is a uh, clearly smaller than 6 so for the second case the last case we have x greater than 1 if x greater than 1 we have to apply the derivative of the function we left f x equal x power of x plus x minus 6 and the derivative of that function we will have the x power of x derivative will become x power of x times ln x plus 1 you can check the detailed solution on my previous, previous video so uh, plus 1 and then you see that we have the table here with x and x is on way greater than 1 until uh, positive infinity and we can easily to see that it's a on way um, positive value when we replace x into a uh, derivative uh, of x f derivative of x so it means f x on ways increasing from 1 to positive infinity this means f x equal zero has one variable only and we can easily to see that two plus two power of two equal six so it means x equal to two because we have we prove that f x equal zero have only one variable once x greater than one so the variable of the equation is x equal to two so now let's look at back to the case why I divide into two cases because when you are throwing um, exponential equation you sometimes most of the case you have divided into a few cases of uh, x variable 
and the basic case normally we check the distance between 0 and 1 and above 1 uh, and we also have uh, another special case but uh, usually we use two case and by this way the second case we can apply the derivative and in derivative we can prove the fx is increasing function so increasing function is mean it's only have one variable during that range of x so if we can find one value of x match with the condition in the range of x and this should be the variable we uh, can find for the equation that's it thanks for watching see you later bye